Starting a few moments ago, the first of four public hearings into the controversial issue of congestion pricing. The toll from the cars that drive south of 60th Street in Manhattan will go to the MTA, which believes congestion pricing will ease traffic and pollution and help pay to upgrade an old subway system. Let the public hearings begin right now. I would News reporter Sonia Rincon live at MTA headquarters in Lower Manhattan. Sonia. Yeah, Bill, the hearing was supposed to begin a few minutes ago oh. here at MTA headquarters, but it is a little delayed and hasn't started just yet. I can tell you more people have signed up to speak at this hearing, both in person and on Zoom, than the 120 that are allowed. The folks coming in person are just arriving now, and this should be getting underway shortly. All of these comments are not expected to have any major impact on the tolling structure already approved and on track to go live in June. There are still tweaks to be made, clearly, and there was, as I said earlier this week, but that'll be up to the board. Uh, that's not certainly within my purview as an Chief Transit President, but obviously uh, the board is here to um, to hear, uh, you know, some maybe closing closing arguments or closing comments from the public. Strong opinions expected tonight as people who will have to pay more or change the way they commute into Manhattan will have two minutes to put their two cents on the record. Yesterday, the MTA board gave an update on the infrastructure, now 95% done. The lawsuits from the state of New Jersey and others, which threaten to delay critical capital funding, and the ways in which they intend to step up enforcement on toll evaders. They even showed this video of two drivers busted with elaborate gadgets used to evade existing tolls and said anyone caught obscuring their plates could get their cars impounded after three offenses. The board tonight is required to hear public opinion about the tolling structure. $15 just once a day for most drivers entering the central business district below 60th Street. There are concerns not just from those who will have to pay the tolls, but about the impacts on areas outside the district. Better transit is our goal. There are also mass transit commuters who stand to benefit from the $15 billion in funding the MTA is counting on. Now, for everybody who wants to speak, there are overflow rooms like this one where people can watch and they can also record their comments and they can do that simultaneously for two minutes at a time. So the board tonight is expected to hear from more than the 120 people who signed up again virtually and in person here at MTA headquarters and we will.